I wonder if anyone else is encountering this. So on Rumble, on Rumble, constant spam messages from these idiots that post this ridiculous stuff. So let me tell you what happens here. Okay, so I have all of my YouTube channels that you know I started with YouTube over on Rumble as, as well. Okay, so I upload the videos over, over to that site. And, you know, we get views and comments and, and likes and, you know, all that sort of stuff there. Not as much as YouTube sometimes. It, it depends on what the topic is. Like, I think when I first started it, it was, I was actually gaining more, more views and subscribers legit on Rumble than I was on YouTube. But then things kind of change a little bit. However, one thing re remained c consistent. And if you upload videos to Rumble, maybe you have encountered this as well. I'm sure you have. So, these freaking scammers, spammers, what they do is they find your video, you get a, a view from them, although all they do is probably just hit play and then pause it, or it's possibly a bot as well, I don't know. They will like your video, they will subscribe to your video, and then they will comment something about, oh, that's a great video, and then they will insert your name to make it seem like it's not a copy and paste response. Like, you know, it's actually something legit. And they're saying, I know of ways you can grow your channel and all this sort of stuff. And they put this big long paragraph that like, your channel has so much potential, you know, just really encouraging stuff. Here's my Telegram. Here's my Discord. Here's my Twitter account or X account or whatever else it is. Here's my Fiverr account and all this other stuff. It's like, huh. And you, you see so much of that, and it's not just copy and paste, it's like a variety of different responses that, it's like the underlying message is the same, but it's not copy and paste word for word, it varies, it's different. And it's these scammers, some of them have profile photos, some of them don't. These freaking idiots, let me say this, I've encountered that on all the channels that I've posted to on Rumble, and I have blocked every single one of those types of comments, okay? So those comments will come through and they are blocked, plain and simple. Um, now what's interesting because it's like, yeah, these people view, like, comment, and even subscribe to your channel on there. So it's like an inflated number of subscribers and, and legit views if it's just this ridiculous stupid bot. Now, I'd be curious how many are going to come in, into these comments that this video gets posted to Rumble. Only I'm going to be able to see that because, as I said, all this sort of ridiculousness is blocked because it's spam. I just really wish Rumble would do a better job at detecting these idiots. I really would. Because it's like, obviously, they're going around spamming basically the same thing to a lot of people's videos. I've gone to like other people's videos in a particular category before just going to various ones and I and I there it is same exact one so whatever the case is rumble needs to definitely do a better job at this anti-bot or anti-spam protection tools I think that's something that they can greatly improve upon because it's just ridiculous it really is I mean it's one time on one of my videos, I received like three messages back to back from all different people basically saying the same exact thing. And all of their comments were blocked because they're idiots. Idiots' comments get blocked automatically. And it's like, uh, Rumble, like, why does, why is that even allowed to be approved? Why was that person's account, if they're a bot, how was that, how did that even go through appropriately? So, I really think that's a major improvement that Rumble can certainly do, and I really hope that they do improve upon that because it's just annoying. It really is because it inflates the number of comments and likes and views and subscribers and all that sort of stuff that a video has. You know, it's like, oh, look, look how many followers you have. But it, then it's like, well, hold on now, like a third of those, well, probably not even a third, probably a little, it depends. <laughs> it, it depends. I don't know. I haven't counted, but it could be like a third. A third of the idiots who are 
subscribed are spammers and scammers that all they do is subscribe comment once and they will never be back they will never be back they will never comment again they will never view again they will never have any sort of interaction whatsoever ever again because that's not how they roll the only reason they subscribe to you is to make it look like they're trustworthy so you sign up for their scam service and contact them on telegram or discord wherever else and and you give them money and because they're not going to do anything they're probably they're probably from from india they're probably scammers from from india and they're scamming you and i really hope that no one falls for it but some people might, so just a heads up. Please don't fall for it. Don't fall for that nonsense. Anyone who's telling you, yeah, I can help improve your channel, they're a lie. They're an absolute lie. No one's going to help you do that. You have to do the work for that, okay? You have to do that. Unless you personally know someone who's good at marketing and all that sort of stuff, don't take any advice from, from some from some random idiot online who posts the same thing on every single person's comments and videos. You know, it's like, come on now. So, yeah, Rumble definitely needs to get their act together when it, when it comes to that. But other than that, you know, it's, it's, a great, it's a great site. It's interesting because I have not encountered that sort of thing on, on other video plat platform sites. So, you know, I, I have all my videos going over to Odyssey as well. I... I've maybe seen one or two spam comments over the years. Haven't really seen too many spam comments. Interesting, right? Um, then again, maybe they only hit people who have like a lot more interactions and engagement because I don't really have too much on there. I don't know how that works. I really don't. Or maybe it's because Rumble's like a better, you know, more popular than Odyssey is. I don't know, but regardless odyssey rumble spam comments i mean you get it on youtube as well remember when people would post um want to be you youtube friends on youtube it's like yeah you're you're a scammer and, and it's like trap house music or something i forget what it is like trap music or something it's like what it's like i don't what is you youtube friends you know, it's like, I don't know what YouTube Friends is. It's like, is that like a variation of, you know, like YouTube Kids? But instead of it being for, for kids, it's just for friends and friends post like videos t to each other. It's like, sure. Yeah, I want to be a YouTube friend of someone I don't even know online who's posting random crap on my videos. Sure. So it just doesn't make any sense. It just doesn't. And the sad thing is that people fall for the, for, for these scams. And that's the thing. It's like, please don't be so g gullible. Usually it's younger people who are gullible and probably, well, I guess if you're really old, you probably don't even know how to upload a YouTube video. But, you know, if, if you do, just realize people aren't gonna... People always have a nefarious... They always have a nefarious scheme of harming you and benefiting themselves in some sort of way. That's how you have to view things when it comes to online people who do not have any name or like a, a, a weird username and no profile picture and they don't have a history of even posting any videos of, of themselves like most of these people they completely lack a name like it's just like a r bunch of random letters and numbers or like a weird username that's not not even a name they don't have a profile picture of themselves they don't have a cover photo they have no videos they have no information those are people who are out to harm you, steal your money, it's only to benefit themselves. They are not here to help you whatsoever. The people who will be here to help you are people who are legit, who actually post, look, like, like me, I post videos, I don't ask for anything in, in return. If you wanna like the video, go ahead. If you wanna dislike the video, go ahead. If you wanna subscribe, go ahead. If you wanna unsubscribe, go ahead. Donate or not donate, go ahead, I don't care what you do because that's not, I'm not here to tell you what to do. I'm not here to make you do something or to, you know, all I'm here to do is just put out information, you take from it whatever it is that you wish. You can, you can say everything I say is a lie 
or you can accept it as true, whatever the case is. But regardless, these scammers, they don't roll like that. They just say, let's try to make up all these lies about how great your content is. I mean, uh, your content may be actually be very, very good, you know, because of course mine is, I mean, come on now. So your content could actually be very, very good, but they're saying, oh, it has so much more potential. You know, it has so much more. Just follow me, donate to me, and I'll help you grow, and, they, and you won't see a single thing. They, I don't even know how far this ends up going. Like, do they ask for your login in information or something? I don't know, but we get into risky t t territory when that sort of stuff happens. Okay, so that was all. Y'all take care, have a great one, and I'll catch you later. Bye-bye.